Hello, my name is John Black, and this is my research proposal about injury prevention in young learners. So, there's a big problem, and that is that many young runners experience injuries throughout their running careers. So, I would know this from personal experience. I've been injured a lot of times, and so that's a big problem for me because it takes time away from running, which is what you want to be doing. So, my question would be, uh, what measures can be taken to prevent injuries in young runners? And to answer this question, some definitions I need are soreness versus injuries. So DOS stands for delayed onset soreness. That's a pain that you feel from your muscles being worked. It usually occurs 40, 48 hours after your initial exercise. So that's not an injury. That's just what, ha what you need for your muscles to develop. Injuries would be like a, a bone fracturing or um, pulling a muscle, and that's something that can't be cured immediately. So my hypothesis is, if certain preventative measures are effectively implemented, the number of injuries will decrease. So some of these um, preventative measures would be like certain stretches, strengthening exercises, that would prevent these injuries from occurring in the first place. And the value to this would be allowing young runners to continue running without being slowed down and having to stop your training and then start over in four months when your injury is done or healed. And my method of inquiry would be mixed method, so I'm going to use both qualitative and quantitative. I'm going to uh, ask people questions, have them answer it, but also do quantitative measurements. So my lit review, I have about 10 sources online. I got them from the, Dale, the Gale database, so they're most likely reliable. And then I have one book that I'm reading about running, basically. And then I have a few expert mentor track coaches, or cross-country coaches also, who would be beneficial to my research, and they can help me out. And to gather my evidence, I'm going to do a lot of prior research so I understand the topic and then observations. And then my ethics, there's not really many ethical considerations. I just need to make sure I keep everyone's names anonymous. So my next step would be basically putting together all the exercises and strengthening that I need to do to most effectively um, prevent injuries. And then also I want to talk to some physical therapists. I've been to a lot of physical therapists over the past few years, so I have connections in that area and I'd like to talk to them about what exercise would be most effective. Uh, basically, I also need more preliminary research. That's what I'm missing right now. And that's just going to help me gather the stretches and exercises I need to use. And then potential issues. I wouldn't want to mess up someone's training plan because people have a goal for the end of their season, whatever that is, that's running at states. They have a certain time they want to hit, and they're basically shooting for that goal, and they have everything planned out. I wouldn't want to mess up something that they have already planned out. So I have to make sure that it's not too like intrusive on their training plan. And that's it. That's my research. Okay. Thank you.